every day I wake up and I'm thrilled to come to work to help people get their lives back from drugs and alcohol. Just over 13 years ago, I founded Solutions Recovery. It is a drug and alcohol rehab in Sin City, Las Vegas. We help people transform their lives. We help people get their lives back from drugs and alcohol uh, every day. And I'm really glad that since addiction, the number one health problem in our community, uh, is, is being acknowledged and recognized as a, as a health problem. I became a, a licensed therapist. Uh, they told me I had to engage in self-care because we can't help others if we don't take care of ourselves. So I, I love fitness. I love to get outside. I have an amazing wife, uh, Carolina, and I'm honored to be her husband. Um, and I love her with all my heart. Congratulations, my love, for earning the Inspired Excellence in Healthcare Award. The boys and I are extremely proud of you. Mwah. I'm most proud that, uh, you know, I have two sons that I have an active role in their life that I have a good relationship with. They're both, uh, they're both men of integrity. Alcoholism is a tricky disease and it doesn't just get solved with a pharmacological intervention or behavioral intervention, or recovery interventions, or court interventions. Each person comes in with their own set of unique challenges and developing a program to help them uh, is, is really key. We've developed things like the Solutions Wellness Campus. We do family day in here. Uh, families have an important role in helping uh, families get better. It's not just healing the addict, but uh, it's healing the whole family. I love when it's full and the energy is just uh, about recovery. It's really special, it's a special place. A yoga studio, a boxing gym, a coffee shop, a salon, all kinds of services that may seem atypical for drug and alcohol treatment, but it ends up creating a warm and welcoming place where people are joyous and happy about being clean and sober. For 13 years now, whoever shows up Friday at five o'clock, we feed them. This is a Common Grounds Cafe. They have uh, smoothies, coffees, sandwiches. They make a mean Philly cheesesteak. This is a, uh, a recovery bookshop or gift shop where they have uh, medallions or coins to help commemorate periods of time in recovery. Uh, each week we offer our clients some kind of uh, spa or salon service. They might get a, a facial or a haircut or get their nails done. We believe not only in helping people physically get over the disease of addiction, but also uh, and have them look better. It's, uh, it's part of the recovery, mind, body, spirit. In here is a music studio Judith Pinkerton has over 200 drums and uh, she's Nevada's first licensed master's level music therapist and she helps a lot of our clients get clean as well. Dave, I'd like to thank you for your contributions to the community that you have been the voice and the conscience of addictions in Southern Nevada. Dave, I couldn't believe how delighted I was when I heard about this award being given to you. Congratulations and Keep doing what you're doing. I walked into your office four years ago and I'm so thankful for that day. Uh, you're an incredible mentor, uh, teacher, boss, and you improve everybody around you and contribute so much to the community. Uh, we appreciate everything that you do. Congratulations. The message that I have for anybody who's struggling, and, and some of you out there are struggling right now, is that if some people think you have a problem, if you wonder if you have a problem, you probably have a problem. Every one of us knows people with drug or alcohol addictions and that we all need to continue to work together to help the community. Congratulations!